YouTubers, Steve Goss Jr., Mississippi Bass Master here. And I got my youngest son, Peyton, with me. Today we want to do a, a, we're going to do a product review today on the new Rivers to Sea uh, crankbait. It's designed by Tactical Bassin. This is the Tactical DD Crank 75. These are for fishing in wintertime for big fish. And uh, we went, in my last video, we fished with them, and uh, I caught several fish that was over four pounds. The biggest one was almost six. So these baits are some really good baits. Uh, these here are the uh, three-quarter ounce. They're three inches long. They have extremely good movement. Uh, you know, for those cold water temperatures, they don't have that. They have a really tight wobble. And the thing that I like about them the best is they don't have all that drag that the like the XD tens or the XD eights do. You know when you're when you're cranking that thing, those XD tens it feels like you're cranking a I don't know it feels like you're cranking a 12 foot boat actually underwater. So, huh. but these right here they don't have a whole lot of drag. You know pull and they run really well really well in the water. And they run anywhere from, you know, 10 to 18 feet deep, I believe, is what they are. Or maybe 15, depending on line size and a real retrieval. But these right here floating, you know, once you stop, they, they come up. But these are some great baits, guys. They haven't been out long. Uh, like I said, they're, they're river-to-sea baits, and they are designed by Tactical Bassin. If you guys haven't checked out Tactical Bassin, you need to. Uh, they... They catch a lot of big fish and target big fish, and I love watching them guys. And uh, when I seen this bait, I seen uh, Matt Allen do a review on it, or he talked about it actually. And uh, I just had to have some of them. You can get them there about fifteen dollars a piece. I bought these actually from Tackle Warehouse. Uh, but overall, I, I was really, really happy with this bait for this time of year. And it, it, without a doubt, it catches big fish because each fish I caught was over four pounds on it. Uh, you know, here in Mississippi, our, our coldest is in the next month or so, we'll reach the coldest temperatures. But right now, water temperature is still in about the 50s, mid 50s. Uh, we've actually had unseasonably warm weather in the mid 60s during the day and at night in the 50s and 40s. So. It hasn't been just terribly cold here, but we have been getting a lot of rain. And, uh, of course, you know, that, that just rain makes everything muddy and just makes it tougher. Already, winter fishing is tough enough, but high-rising water makes it even tougher. But I was really impressed with these baits, guys. I, I really was. This is actually the, uh, let's see. This is the DD Minnow color. And this one here is the ghost minnow, which it's just got a chrome side on it. I uh, fished with this one the other day also, but uh, they seem to like this one right here a little bit better for the, for the time being and the water clarity and everything. Once again, these are rivers, River to Sea Tactical DD Crank 75, designed by uh, tactical bass. So if you guys haven't tried them, check them out. Winter time, big bass fishing. These are a must have. And I assure you, if you run big crankbaits, you will absolutely love the way this thing runs in the water. It casts really well. Uh, it, it's just designed, they designed this bait right. If you, if you see Matt, uh, Matt Allen's video of where he's talking about this bait everything he says is true this bait will make it happen for you so uh just wanted to do a product review guys i'm gonna do a little bit more of this uh you know this is a new year 2020 hopefully this is gonna be a really good year for us peyton's gonna start uh, tournament fishing this year at age 11 and we're gonna have a a youth team and i'm gonna coach so Really looking forward to that, and then plus I'm going to continue to club fish my tournament some, and going to fish a few other big tournaments. Going to fish the St. Jude Classic again this year, which is the biggest open tournament in the state of Mississippi, and uh, probably going to try to fish a couple of big bass bashes this year. Also, 
But the first thing is we got to get this boat motor fixed. So we're in the workings of that financially right now. Good Lord willing, it's going. Everything's going to work out, and we'll be ready to go before tournament season. Um, Peyton and them's first tournament is actually going to be April the 18th, I believe, on Lake Pickwick, which is going to be an awesome place to start the year off. Can't wait. Should be perfect spawning season. Uh, we're going to do a lot of video, and, and their tournaments you will actually be able to see through Tactical Bass, and you'll be able to see on live TV. They really make it good for these kids and then treat them like they're, you know, uh, like Mike and Nelly or Kevin Van Dam or anybody. They put them on a big stage during weigh-ins, uh, do live TVs, you know, sponsors, you know, it's really going to be fun. They'll have a chance to win thousands of dollars in scholarships, which my team is junior, so they won't be able to win scholarships yet, but they'll still be able to win thousands of dollars in cash and prizes, and it's just going to be a fun learning experience for me and for them. And, uh, you know, just try to give back to the community and do something for these kids. You know, uh, not all kids are, are born athletes or football players and baseball players, you know, so this this is another way for to give kids, uh, you know, something else to do in the community. And uh, hopefully with time, our team will grow. Uh, I believe we're going to name our team the Mississippi Bass Smashers. And uh, since I've already started all that, you know, being the Mississippi Bass Smasher, uh, hopefully we'll, we can grow our team and, uh, you know, find some other coaches that want to fish for boats so we can bring more kids in and, and uh, get them involved in it also. But uh, I hope you guys uh, like my videos. Hopefully we'll be able to make you some really good videos this year. Last year was a pretty tough time for me. I went through a lot of stuff, but we still managed to get some fishing in for you guys. And uh, hopefully 2020 is going to start off right and uh, be a good year for us. And hopefully our channel will grow. In the next couple of months, I'm going to be doing some huge giveaways. I ain't going to reveal what I'm going to do yet, but I can tell you it's going to be huge giveaways. So please share these videos and uh, like them. Uh, the more support I get, man, you guys just don't know how much I appreciate it. But back to the bait, uh, a little bit more about the bait. I was actually throwing this on a lose medium action 7-3 uh, rod with a... Uh, Black Max, Abu Garcia, Black Max. Peyton just got him a Black Max, Abu Garcia, and uh, he loves it, which I've got a few that he's fished with before, and I think that's what I'm going to get my, uh, all, both of my teammates, I'm going I'm to buy them uh, Abu Garcia to fish with. It's a good reel to start out with, young, uh, you know, and it's not just overly expensive, but guys, check out these baits. If you like cranking wintertime for big bass, these are a must-have. Rivers to Sea Tactical DD Crank 75. This is a floating bait. It goes from 0 to 18 feet, and it's 3 inches long. They also have some different series sizes, you know, for uh, bigger baits, smaller baits. But this bait right here, this bait right here, make it happen. Until next time, guys, peace out.